got a question in the comments that said, I'm still trying to understand what role the relays play as far as storage. And it's a common type of question I've heard similar in the past. So I wanted to address this. It says, a relay sounds like it just takes something in and sends it back out. From what little I can find about it, it sounds like it stores everything it gets in. How will the ever-growing database be managed without relays becoming essentially centralized? Because they will grow so big, they will need to be subsidized. The basic understanding here is correct, that a relay uh, does receive messages and it will typically store the messages so that they can be retrieved. But there's no guarantee of how long a relay will store a message when it may choose to purge a message. And so that's really up to the relationship that the relay has with clients or users. So if I'm a user, I download an app, say Domus, and hook up to a specific relay, uh, I don't. there's no expectation that that relay has to keep my messages forever. It may just choose to carry them right now for a week, for a month. There's no real commitment. But let's imagine that I wanted to work with a relay that was going to commit to me. Well, you could imagine that the ever-growing database would need to be managed and so what I could do is I could pay that relay some Satoshis, so some little fractions of a Bitcoin. I could pay that relay and in their you know, service could say, look, if you pay me, I don't know, 5,000 Satoshis per month, I will keep holding your messages indefinitely or I'll hold 10,000 of your messages for the next year, right? So all of those are new types of relationships and pricing and service levels that can emerge. Now, mostly we don't have those things emerged yet. So mostly it's hobbyists playing around, setting up relays, trying things out. There's some paid relays that have been started and I'm gonna make a tutorial about that. But the whole ecosystem is very raw still, it's very new. And so we don't know the answer to all these, but it's not a guarantee that that is gonna lead to centralization. It may just lead to like a flourishing of different styles of relays, different service level agreements, and it also, you always have the option to run your own personal relay that could be both for your in your ability to ensure that these messages will be persistently available and backed up forever. Um, and you can push those things from your personal relay out to a set of relays that people who follow you may be looking for. So there's a whole new design space here and it's not all figured out. But right now, relays do receive messages and they do store them, but they don't store them for any specific guaranteed time period. And so that kind of layer of uh, service quality could get layered in later. And I think we're already starting to see this with some of the paid relays. So that's, uh, I hope that clears up the question and let me know if you have others.